Hello XDC family and welcome back to Crypto Ready. If you want to be ready for crypto then you are in the right place. Looking at a tweet from Rohit, World Economic Forum and XDC. We are looking at a potential partnership guys. I'm not going to go into the document because some of the key screenshots have already been taken and as you can see from this document it's from the World Trade Organization and the WEF talking about policy approaches to harness trade digitalization. Where have we heard digitalization for trade before? We talk about it on XDC every single day. XDC is at the center of this transformation. And as you can see on this document from World Economic Forum, it clearly tells you here, Trade Finex enables bank and non-bank trade finance entities to transform their trade documents into tokens, which can be sold in secondary markets and generate liquidity. And you can see here clearly highlighted based on the Zinfin XTC blockchain, okay? And then you've got Trade Tech, all right? Trade Tech is a huge player in the trade finance industry revolution, and XTC is the only blockchain part of this initiative, all right? Just remember that. And what they say here, guys, is that Trade Tech is a technology provider for trade finance asset distribution, and they completed this in September 2021, guys, which was the world's first trade finance-based non-fungible token transaction. September 2021, come on guys, wake up. They have been testing this technology for so many years, all right? They know that NFTs are gonna replace a lot of the documentation as well. Documentations are gonna be NFTs, they're gonna be tokens, it's gonna be all tokenized, all right? And XTC is at the heart of this trillion dollar transformation because the gap for trade finance, it just gets bigger year by year. And do you think they can wait till 2026, 2025? I mean, I don't know, guys. The shift has been happening for so many years already. And I think this year is bringing regulations because we've got so much talk about regulations right now. And if there are organizations out there waiting for regulations before they start disrupting this market, then they are going to be left behind. Which is why XDC is already here. It's already at the heart of all this. It's going to make that change. And when we get that green light, it's going to be the first one through the gate, guys, okay? Carrying on with this, the trade finance NFT transaction was conducted on the Singapore-based XDC network, operated by Zinfin. And you've got World Trade Organization. You've got the World Economic Forum telling you this. And just remember that nothing goes through the trade system without the World Trade Organization. And yes, sometimes I do believe that the World Economic Forum has a lot to play in this. Because they do play a lot of the agendas guys they do lead a lot of the agendas in the world more and more agendas are brewing guys they want people simply out of this crypto market they don't want you to be rich simple they don't want you to be free from their system so i hope you're paying attention to xdc because it all ties back to the xdc network because as you can see this trillion dollar market is on the xdc network and once regulations come in xdc will already be the leader because it's already the leader for me guys it's number one in the blockchain space so please pay attention let's move on to the next bit as you can see from the screenshot trade tech bridges the technology gap in the 15 trillion dollar trade finance market there is a 1.5 billion process volume 30,000 plus invoices financed and 5,000 plus corpus funded and what does that lead to guys xdc network because the tokenized infrastructure and all this system is built upon the XTC network, guys. As you can see on the right side, the technology that powers asset distribution, one platform, one goal, fully interoperable for the capital markets. You're talking about trillions and trillions of dollars, guys, and they need blockchain to help them solve the problems they're facing today. Why is MLETR moving in the parliament right now in the UK? Because they need this technology. That's the only way they're going to move into this new digital revolution. And Trade Tech, guys, you already know it's bringing the trader token to the XTC network. It's based upon the XTC network. And XTC is the only network, only blockchain part of this trillion dollar initiative. So please pay attention. Let's move on to the next bit. Looking at a tweet from DMT Williams. A list of ISO 20022 compliant projects. XRP and XLM are a member of the ISO body. And then you have XTC, IOTA, Algorand, HBAR, QNT, and ADA. Some of them are rumored to be compliant. But XTC, guys, we definitely know is a ISO compliant project. So these are a handful of the projects, guys, that are going to make waves in the world of finance. And they are definitely worth your time and attention. I'm not a financial advisor, guys, but 
you should do your research and give it some time and thought because these projects are going to change your life in the very near future. Please do not ever invest anything more than you can afford to lose. Okay, let's move on to the next bit. Looking at a tweet from Darren Lewis Jr. The TFD initiative. XTC Network focuses on international trade and finance with a hybrid architecture. XTC Network fixes the loopholes in global financing and trade. So let's have a look at these screen grabs. And as you can see here, there are many members for the TFD initiative. You've got many huge banks such as ING, HSBC, Lloyds Bank, who are currently using the blockchain. And just remember guys that XDC is the only blockchain company part of the TFD initiative. XDC network focuses on international trade and finance. It has developed a highly secure, permissioned and scalable commercial grade architecture. With a hybrid architecture, XDC network fixes the loopholes in the global financing and trade. This helps financial industries by providing them with instant and real-time settlement via smart contracts. The XTC network is powered by the XTC01 protocol. The XTC protocol is created to support the smart contracts layer and AML and KYC layer. So the XTC network is already working within regulations. They are already working to KYC AML, which is the requirements of the regulators. And when all these huge organizations make that move to blockchain technology, what blockchain are they gonna use? It's pretty obvious, right? XTC being the only blockchain on the TFD initiative, it's an obvious answer. They're going to be using the XTC network. So definitely pay attention to this, guys, because XTC is going places. Let's move on to the next bit. So how does the R3 Corda system operate? R3 has attracted interest from 40 plus banks that pay millions of dollars to join its consortium to work together on the Corda technology. Moreover, they develop projects through working groups focused on specific use cases such as trade finance or KYC and AML compliance requirements. In 2015, guys, R3 announced they were partnering with leading financial institutions, okay, to develop the structure of DLT on the R3 quarter platform. And just remember once again, XDC has been selected to be the settlement token on our three quarter network so just imagine how huge this opportunity is for xdc network and the current ceo david e rotter he found our three guys and he has been a former ceo of swift okay and he was managing eleven thousand banks worldwide so imagine how huge this opportunity is for xdc okay he was a former ceo of swift okay swift moves trillions of dollars every single day and Swift is currently getting ready to move to the new ISO 20022 standard from mid-November. And XDC is an ISO compliant project, okay? You're not gonna see instant gains once ISO goes live, but as we go down the months and the year or so, I think we are gonna start to see huge uptrends in ISO compliant projects. And XDC is definitely one of them that's gonna be moving very soon to the upward direction. So the R3 quarter guys is based on a DLT system, okay? And it focuses on interoperability between blockchains that makes it easier for companies to share services and data in a secure environment. So it's based on DLT, it's based on XTC, okay? XTC makes R3 quarter a hybrid system. So R3 quarter guys is a powerful DLT platform for financial services, okay? It has been used by banks, governments, and other large organizations to build and run their blockchain networks. So what are the main benefits of Coda? Coda is not a public DLT, but it can be connected to one to access the wider community and its resources. A high level of privacy, including control over which parties see what information about transactions on the network and a built-in legal framework that provides consistency across different jurisdictions. Great news, okay? It has a built-in legal framework. Banks have been trusting it for many years, okay? Everybody is moving on to the blockchain and R3 has already interconnected its system and it's already based on the blockchain. And it's clearly XTC network, okay, people? So like they say here, all participating organizations and banks can benefit from this new technology, which will improve efficiency, okay? It is leading us into the carbon net zero system. Blockchain is gonna lead to that because it's gonna save loads of money and it's gonna be energy efficient, okay? And XTC is definitely one of the greenest blockchains out there. Why do you think it has been chosen by R3 many years ago? So why do you think XTC network was chosen for this by R3 Corda? Because it fits the bill, people. Okay, R3 Corda is not a small company. 
it moves trillions of dollars across the world for trillion dollar organizations. And that includes banks, governments, and all sorts of other high level organizations, okay? XTC is definitely a diamond in the rough, okay? So just have your diamond hands, keep your XTC safe, and just huddle on strong, and just show a bit more patience, because our time will come very soon. That is it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, you know what to do. Please hit that subscribe button. Please like this video so I can spread the news about XTC as usual, like fire on YouTube. And please share this video with family and friends and let them know that Crypto Ready is the place for them to be if they want to be ready for crypto. I shall see you on another video tomorrow. I hope you have a lovely day. Take care. Bye-bye.